Hummingbirds are pure delight. Shimmering colors, wings beating up to 80 times a second. But there's a furnace beneath those feathers. This is infrared, a glimpse of a hummingbird's internal heat, metabolism at full burn. When a hummingbird is hovering, with its heart beating more than a thousand times a minute, it burns more energy ounce for ounce than any other bird or mammal. But wait, here's that same bird at night with its metabolism slowed to a crawl. It's in a state called torpor. Heartbeat and temperature have dropped so low that the bird is using 1 50th of the energy it would use if it were zooming around during the day. Good thing. Otherwise, in eight hours without feeding, it could starve to death. No wonder scientists have long studied these birds. Ken Welch, for one, has spent more than a decade figuring out how these birds manage their energy budgets. I learned to become a bit of the hummingbird whisperer, and eventually I, I figured out how to think like a hummingbird and how to get them to cooperate. Here's how their metabolism works. Hummingbirds are much better than most animals at switching between fat and sugar to power their muscles. And since they feed on nectar that is half glucose and half fructose, they've evolved a way to send that fructose directly to their muscles to use. Humans mainly fuel their body through glucose. For us, fructose, as in high fructose corn syrup, goes straight to fat. And even glucose doesn't move to human muscles as quickly. But hummingbirds can essentially mainline nectar. In 15 minutes, their flight muscles are burning sugars that they have just swallowed. In order to study these birds, Welch has to train them to hover and drink with their head in a mask that measures oxygen use. The mask is a lot like those used on humans, with a slight difference in results. Their metabolic rate when they're hovering is pound for pound, 10 times what an elite human athlete can achieve. What Welch and his colleagues have studied recently is how size relates to energy efficiency. Some hummingbirds weigh less than a penny. Some weigh 10 times more, almost a full ounce. As you can see, little birds have to beat their wings a lot faster to hover. And what Welch discovered is that the faster the wing beats, the less efficient the energy use. What does it all mean? Hummingbirds are pure delight, both to the eye and to science. Hello YouTube, I'm Jim Gorman, the host of Science Take, the show you just saw. If you don't mind snakes and you're not squeamish and you're curious about science, subscribe to the channel below.